we will compromise, we will compromise, and we will compromise in order to come to a speedy agreement. But we're not going to end up being compromised. Greece's confrontational finance minister Yanis Varoufakis said on Monday he would step down from his position, despite the country voting no to demands from international lenders in a referendum. Από αύριο, η Ευρώπη, τις οποίες η καρδιά σήμερα το βράδυ χτυπάει στην Ελλάδα, αρχίζει να γιατρεύει τις πληγές της, τις πληγές μας. Το όχι το σημερινό είναι ένα μεγάλο νέο στη δημοκρατική Ευρώπη. He resigned via his blog and put his departure due to a certain preference by some Eurogroup participants and assorted partners for my absence from its meetings, an idea that the Prime Minister judged to be potentially helpful to him and reaching an agreement. Mr. Varoufakis was appointed Finance Minister in January 2015. As of today, we're beginning to be co-authors of our destiny, co-authors of the reforms that we want to implement which we are going to dictate, which we will discuss with our partners. His tenure was one of the shortest as a finance minister for a European country. Now remember, our government was elected to challenge the philosophy of the program. We were not interested in some cosmetic changes. He caused great irritation among his colleagues in the Eurozone and lectured them on the failure of the region's economic policies. The Eurogroup has used terrorist methods by which to blackmail us into accepting a non-viable agreement. Now, what is terrorism? It's the pursuit of political agendas by means of inspiring fear in people, uh, mind-numbing fear. Well, the um, choice that we were given, accept a non-viable agreement, or we we'll shut your banks, can be classified as such. As negotiations continued, Mr. Varoufakis continued to take a hard line against creditors. Well, I wish that we had the drachma. Make no mistake, this is not the statement that I want the drachma. I wish we had the drachma. I wish we had never entered this monetary union. And I think that deep down, all member states of the Eurozone would agree with that now, because it was very badly constructed. But once you're in, you don't get out without a catastrophe. On April 26, he quoted Franklin D. Roosevelt in a tweet. They are ununanimous in their hate for me, and I welcome their hatred. A quotation close to my heart and reality these days. Mr. Varoufakis had a distinctive style, riding to meetings on his motorcycle, and a fashion sense not normally associated with finance ministers. Would you yeah? resign if there's a yes vote? Mr. Absolutely. Absolutely. And there won't be a yes vote. Tonight you so will you're resign stuck with me. If, if, if there's a yes vote.